Hello everyone and welcome to Creative Design and Supply. Today I want to show you how to design a custom banner for us to print for you. Um, now I will tell you that with Canva you will need Canva Pro. Um, I believe for single uh, it's $12.99 but it's a 30-day free trial but you will need the paid version because you have to save it as a transparent PNG and I will show you step by step in this video. So I'm um, right up here, I'm going to, right here, you're going to need to go to custom size and you're going to want to make sure, sometimes it's usually at PX when you start this, but I have done this with inches for um, a long time. So I like to go ahead and uh, do the inches. And then you see right here, I am going to do the two by four um, foot banner. All right, so now it gives you all of the space for you to work. Now, the good thing about the pro version is you get to use all the neat elements. All right, so what I like to do before, if I want to make a cute frame, I'm going to select this and you're going to get a color code up here. And um, I'm just going to give it a color. Um, something like that. I mean, you can even do that. That's really cool too. So then now that I have a border that I like, I'm going to come over to my elements again. And then I'm going to go to my shapes, which I use a lot to make my frames. And then I am just going to So now I want to make this white. So now I'm going to come up here and I'm going to change my color. Okay. Now you have this cute um, gradient background. Now I'm going to go back over to my elements and I'm going to look for equation uh, backgrounds. Um, you could even use this. So here I'm going to go ahead and change my background. I'm going to re place my background. Now you see that that looks really neat. Um, I may want graphics. You can, there's a bunch of neat little ones that you can, you can slide over or however you would like. Um, I'm actually I'm going to do a photo or a frame and then this is just to show you, you don't have to do it this way. Now I'm going to go to photos because I need So I'm just going to say that it, and if you want to um, upload a photo, say you don't have the photo, you're going to come over here, you're going to click upload photos and wherever you save that photo, you would grab that from. So I don't have a graduation photo, so I'm going to just going to use one of these. So now I'm going to pull this over here, but the cool thing is as long as you have you want to make sure that this is highlighted. You're going to come over here and you're going to go to edit photo. Magic eraser. There's a lot of neat things, but I just want to remove the background. Okay. So now I am just going to put her in here, but I'm going to make sure that she is at the size that I want, so that way she's all in the frame. Okay. And then over here, you can even, um, you can type in or you can do elements and I want graphics. Okay. So right over here, I have that. Um, and you can change the color. And the good thing about this is you have a color palette. I'm just trying to make sure that this is 
So your color palette, and if you, your color palettes are up here, how you wanna change it. So I can change it to that color. So we're just gonna use this one because some of them you can change and some of them you can't. Um, and now if I want to go and I'm just going to put a name, whoop, okay. And then over here, you can change it. So you can change it to any one that you want. Um, And then if you need to make it bigger, um, I will tell you, you want to grab and drag from the side because if you see how that goes, okay? So you always wanna drag from the side, that way you get the whole entire thing. So now I wanna change the color of this. Whoops. Okay, to match that. And then you just wanna make sure you can either level it, you see my X. So now it's centered. I can grab both of these, whoops, Control Z, if you move something, okay? All right. So you want to save as a transparent PNG. So you come over here and you go to click download. You wanna make sure that you are on PNG. Those are all the options for this. So the PDF, I do not suggest, um, even though it says best for printing, that's not what we need. We want PNG and you are gonna click transparent background. All right, and then you would download. I um, am just gonna download this in the downloads and then I'm going to take you to our website to show you, okay? All right, so now we're gonna come over here and actually let me go back to the home, all right? So now you're going to go to custom DTF UV gang sheet and banner upload. All right, now you're gonna select the banners and the banners are 50% off right now, which are great for sports and graduation. So let's go ahead and go over those. So I made that for two by 24, okay? And then right up here, you're going to need to check this that you understand that creative design and supply does not print images that are subject to copyright or trademark laws. By uploading your images to the website, you agree that and certify that you own the rights to this image. Um, if you're unsure about that, I would go over the copyright and trademark laws, but we are going to click that and then right here, we are going to choose our file. All right, so now you can go to your documents or downloads wherever you have that. And then I'm gonna click right there. So now my Cassie one ENG, is there. Now you can do a rush order, um, we'll be charged an additional $25 and we'll be ready within one business day. All right, you're going to add to cart and I believe there will be one more in it so it will not show 36. So yes. So let me view my cart real quick and show you I've already. Okay, and then you would have your taxes 39.40, and you would um, either choose shipping or pick up in the store if you're local to Bossier City, Louisiana. All right, and then that is how you do that. If you have any questions, you can comment below, and I would be glad to answer them for you, and as always, have a great day. Thanks.